for you. In my goal to face my fears of horror games, I find myself here with Blooper Team's latest title that's inspired by a cult classic horror film franchise. Luckily for me, there's a cute dog in the game that makes everything better in this terrifying adventure. I'm Brad Crespo and this is Noise Pixel's review of Blair Witch, written by Lynn Carmella. Blair Witch follows Ellis, a former police officer who is harboring bad memories. One day, a child disappears in the Black Hills Forest, and Ellis decides to join the search. With his loyal dog Bullet, nothing can go wrong, right? Well, as Ellis goes through the woods, he soon notices that strange things are going on and that maybe the rumors of the area being haunted are more accurate than he thought. So first and foremost, it's important to mention that Bullet's inclusion in this horror adventure happens to be one of my favorite parts of the game. However, he isn't only there for you to be able to feel reassured, he is also an important tool for the player as he serves as a helpful navigator through the woods. There is even the option to pet him, and it simply looks adorable since he looks so overly happy when the player gives him some attention. There's definitely a cute side of Blair Witch, but of course, it is an atmospheric horror game where occasional jump scares do happen. That said, it focuses on other elements to scare you, such as dark and frightening environments, creepy sounds and weird items. One of the main tools that makes exploration a little bit easier is the camera, which lets you see things when it's dark and gives you the option to watch tapes you will find along the way. I found the tape feature realistic as you can re-watch the obtained tape anytime and can pause it as well as fast forward or rewind the video. The scary thing here is that your environment might change as well while watching the tape. This feature actually brings about a sort of puzzle solving element to the game. Another helpful tool is the flashlight, which actually ties in with the game's combat. Basically, you use the flashlight to blind enemies. So technically, you're not killing enemies per se, but you just scare them off as they seem to be sensitive to light. Like other games from the developer, there are chase and run elements within the game as well, and it is possible to die during certain events. Overall though, Blair Witch is quite a linear game, and you basically only have one way to advance. But I do admit that I found myself lost a few times as I aimlessly wandered around trying to figure out what to do or where to go next. Getting lost isn't as big of a problem because Blair Witch is simply stunning, with its fantastic environments that you can't help but want to explore. Additionally, the soundtracks are very creepy and help create an immersive, scary atmosphere. To sum it all up, I found Blair Witch to be a great horror game, plus it has Bullet, and in all honesty, the pet function was the best feature in the game. For fans of atmospheric or psychological horror games, or even the Blair Witch franchise, this game is for you. Noise Pixel is giving Blair Witch an 8 out of 10. Thanks for watching. You can read our full review at noisepixel.net. Noisepixel is run by a group of gamers who work hard to deliver news, reviews, previews, and more. Please subscribe to keep up with all of our future content.